What's up guys, this is White Fang, and today I will be opening some Pokemon Online TCG packs. I will be opening 30 packs. I got a wide variety of them, so yeah, let's get straight straight into this. But before I want but before I want to mention that as this time that I am recording this, Guardian uh, Sun and Moon Guardians Rising has not come out has not came out yet. So I'm just expecting that. And yeah, let's go to the packs. I do not play the online TCG very much, so I usually have a collection of booster packs. I don't know why this isn't working. Okay, there we go. So we have one Generations, one Sun and Moon, we have two XY base set. <clears throat> Sorry. I have a Breakpoint, a Breakthrough, eight Evolutions, two Fates Collide, two Flash Fire, two Furious Fists, five Phantom Forces, three Primal Clash, one Roaring Skies, two Steam Siege, and then a Pikachu themed Avatar collection box. So yeah, I think I'm going to start with my least favorite sets, starting with XY base set. So yeah, out of this XY base set, I'm just hoping to pull any, maybe the full art Charizard. I haven't opened any XY base yet, or I guess I have, and the rare is, a, okay, so it's not, it's not a revert, it's not a hollow or an ultra rare, but it's okay, so we're on to our last pack of XY base set, oh, we got a rare reverse hollow, nice, and, the ground pick. So we got a rare reverse hollow, Aegislash, which isn't too bad. And now I'm going to go to break, yeah, breakthrough. I would say my favorite card from breakthrough is maybe the Mega Houndoom full art. Ooh, rare reverse hollow. Ooh, Azora break. I totally forgot about it. I totally forgot about Brace, even though it's called. Oh yeah, there we go, and a Houndoom EX, a double ultra rare, a double ultra rare pack. This is a great pack. Onto Breakthrough, let me break point. Greninja on the front. I need to get more energies, because I'm running out, or I don't have enough. Kibble, and a set. I'm saving Flash Fire for last because that's my all-time favorite set. So I'm probably gonna go, mm, yeah, Steam Siege. The only card I really like out of this set is the Fuller Mega Guard of War EX and the normal Card of War EX. I think when I first opened Steam Siege, out of five packs, I pulled the Mega Guard of War, but it wasn't the full art. Ooh, yes, and there we go. Speaking of Gardevoir, it's the Gardevoir EX Full Art, because Gardevoir is my favorite Pokemon, so I'm always happy to get these cards. And the rare is a Nidoking. Primal Clash. Uh, maybe Furious Fist. I've, I've had really amazing luck with Furious Fist, but I don't really like the set. Hopefully we get like a Mega Lucario or Mega Heracross. Oh, a Dragon IDX. I have this card in real life and I really like the artwork on it, so that was good. Good pull. Now I think onto Phantom Forces and the card I'm really hoping to get out of Phantom Forces is the Secret Rare Silver Dialga card. A lot of people want it, I know that for sure, and I haven't ever pulled it. It would, be just, it would just be amazing to get it, and it dig Digger's B. And out of Flash Fire, I'm gonna save that for last, along with Generations. I'm hoping to pull the Secret Rare Charizard, or Mega Charizard EX. Expert, X-Form, I think. I, I got the, um, I got the Mega Charizard X, but it's not Secret Rare, so it's only worth about 30 to 40 dollars, but... On the online, ooh, a Pyro Hollow. But on on the online TCG, 
it's not worth that much as in real life. Okay, reverse hollow. Heliolith. Okay. Well, I don't have this card. And a blue Sharna. This is our last pack, Phantom Forces, and then we're going to move on to Primal Clash. Ooh, Mega Gengar EX, this is good. Even though it's not Secret Rare, it's a really great card with Phantom Gate. Okay, so now I think I'm gonna go, yeah, Primal Clash. Primal Clash, Roaring Skies, and then Sun and Moon. And I'm just gonna keep going on from there. Primal Clash, once again, I want the... Ooh, Flygon. A Mega Gardevoir. Or a Mega Rayquaza. The secret rare versions are really cool. They're really powerful. But if I were to get any of the secret rares, I'd probably get Kyogre. I really like the artwork on that. Excadrill. Rare Reverse Hollow and a Grab. And last pack of. Um, my mind's blanking. The last pack of Primal Clash. There we go. Is a Azumarill, so no Ultra Rares. Boring Skies. Sun, and then it's gonna go Sun and Moon, Fates Collide. And then Generation, Flash Fire, and then the Pikachu theme. Box. Yeah. Ooh, Reshiram. And a Articuno. Sun and Moon. I only have one pack of Sun and Moon. I traded a lot before the video, and I imported all my code cards, and that's how I get, that's how I got all these. I traded away most of my Sun and Moon for other packs, because I know the pull rates on Sun and Moon are horrible, it's like a GX in every 9 packs. So, yep, Apollo Sand. Wasn't really expecting much from Sun and Moon. But hopefully that the packs in uh, Guardians Rising are a lot better. Fates Collide. Oh, I completely forgot about Evolutions. Evolutions is one of my favorite sets. Because of the Mega Charizard. Full art. Be break. It is a break. Delphox. Yeah, Delphox break. And. Fate Carbon. Not hollow rare. So now onto the Fates Collide. I'm hoping to get that. Mega Alakazam Full Art. We have Moltres, Rare Reverse Hollow, and a Delphox. So we got a Delphox Break and a Delphox Hollow. Now on to Evolutions. Break card. Yep, Starmie Break. And a Farfetch. So whenever you see three cards that you have to flip over, that means you're guaranteed a secret rare. Hopefully I get one so I can show you guys how it looks like a Dugon. I have gotten a secret rare break card and a ultra rare before, even though the ultra rare was a slow bro. It's still cool to get that. The break card was, I believe it was the Nido King break, so it's not the best break. Ooh, a Mega Pidgeot EX Full Art. This is an awesome card. I've pulled this card maybe three to four times in real life. So we have t uh, three more packs, including this one. Pikachu, Steel, Radicate. I believe in the base set, Radicate and Shadowy Bite. I think it's a question mark and not 60 times. I'm not sure though. You can let me know in the comments if I'm right about that or not. Another Dugong. So we got Seal and Dugong. Our last evolutions pack. No more the generation. Flashfire. In Arcanine. No ultra, uh, yeah, we did get an ultra rare. So now generations, I'm hoping for the Mega Charizard. I've broken uh, the Mega Charizard twice, but I traded it away, not knowing how much it was worth. So 
so I still have one. Ooh, okay, so raiding collection card. Nice Pikachu. I think it's like Snuggle Party Pikachu or something like that. I'm not sure. And a Hitmonlee. So we got an Ultra Rare. That's good. And now onto Flash Fire. My favorite set. Hopefully, I get at least one, like, maybe crazy card, like a Full Art. Or a Mega Kangaskhan. That would be cool. I'm not sure though. Solid goal. Last pack. So far, we don't have the best pulls, but we got some pretty cool cards. Oh, barbacle. And a wall. So, not much. So, here's the Avatar collection box Pikachu. I'm not sure what's inside, but, okay, so we got, we got some pretty cool items. And, yeah, so, yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. And I'll see you guys next time. Be sure to like, subscribe, and to watch my other videos. And leave a leave a comment down below telling me what was your what was the best pull that I got in the game or your favorite. So yeah. See you guys and yeah. Bye.